Shalom everyone! Welcome to the first video of Da'ati, the place where spiritual wisdom finds a home in practical, everyday, physical truth. Now, there's a beautiful teaching that says, we're going to jump right in and hopefully make some headway. There's a beautiful teaching that says, this is a spiritual Kabbalistic idea found in the rabbinical writings, that in creation there are divine sparks strewn everywhere. That is, sparks of godliness are found in every environment a person encounters. But what does it mean, divine sparks? Truth be told, in my imagination, I conjure up this image of little fireflies trapped in darkness or trapped in shells. What does it mean, divine sparks? So think of divine sparks as being nothing more than divine opportunities. You have a myriad of opportunities to make this world a godly place. So what's an example of that? The body, like the world, is physical. The soul hides inside and is longing to come out. Everything you do, everyone you encounter, is a spiritual opportunity to take a spark hiding somewhere in a physical experience, extract it, and reveal it. Take, for example, eating and drinking. Now, eating and drinking is a simple, everyday, physical necessity. You, as the old Zen saying goes, you eat when you're hungry, you drink when you're thirsty, or something like that. Basically, eating and drinking is something for the body, so how does one make that into a spiritual experience? Simple. You stop, you look at the food, you recognize the goodness and from whom the food comes, you make a blessing, and then you eat, then you imbibe. Such an experience combines the physical act of eating and drinking with the deeper spiritual act of making it part of your soul. Likewise, making money. Every single week, we go out, we make money, hopefully you'll all be blessed to have great prosperity. If I take a portion of that money and set it aside for charity, for holy purposes, I spiritualize the money. So the task is not physical or spiritual. The task is to make the physical into something spiritual. So lesson of the day is, take your everyday physical world and make it into something godly. Use it for something spiritual and you will see tremendous success. Be blessed. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you again next time.